What's going on guys, how's your Welcome back to another Minecraft video and today we are here back on Sky Realms for episode 3 of our Skyblock series. Hope you guys all enjoyed today's episode. Um, thank you guys all so much for the support on the videos lately guys. I know a bunch of you guys are new to my channel so if you are, welcome. If you guys are a returning subscriber, I hope you guys all enjoyed today's video. So in this video we're going to go do some PvP, some challenges, and also I'm going to show you guys off what the Sky God um, Island looks like, you know, like the Donator Island. So I uh, hope you guys all enjoyed today's episode. If you guys have any suggestions for what you guys want me to do in the future, make sure to comment down below and um, I will read all of your suggestions and, you know, give you guys uh, like a comment, like if I liked your suggestion. Uh, so yeah, make sure to leave your comments in the, in the comment section below so I can read all of them because I really want to know what you guys want me to do. Uh, like if you guys want me to do more PvP, more challenges, or, you know, just go look at your guys' islands. Um, so yeah, like I said, hope you guys all enjoy and I'll see you guys all in the next video. Peace out. Alright guys, so as you can see, we're here now on the Sky God Island. So this is a rank that you can um, buy and you will get this island. Uh, you know, you can buy the rank by doing slash buy in game, going to the ranks and boom right there. Uh, the Sky God, which is the top rank. Uh, so once you purchase that rank, you'll be able to slash claim and you'll get this cool little island right here. Um, so I'm going to give you guys a quick little tour of it right now. I'm just on my friend's uh, Sky God Island, just showing you guys off, you know, what it comes with and everything. Uh, so right off to our left, you guys can see there's already a beetroot farm right here, a uh, potato farm, and uh, there's also a wheat farm right down there. Uh, so that is also pretty cool. You know, you guys can start off with a farm um, that quickly. Uh, you can see a bunch of chests here to store stuff, uh, some brewing sands, cauldrons down there. Uh, wow, I didn't even know that there was a furnace room up here, but that's pretty cool. You know, you can go smell all your stuff um, up there. Uh, if we go over here into the main uh, huge tower building, um, on this side, I'm not sure if there's anything here. Uh, that's probably a trash pit. I'm pretty sure that this is a trash pit. Like, uh, you can put um, lava down there and you just throw your trash in there. I'm not really sure what that is. Uh, if we go over here, just some places you can go store some stuff at. Um, up here, you know, just some more storage space. Uh, I need to go eat really quick. Okay, so if we go to this balcony, um, yeah, I don't know, just cool little balcony that you can look down and see the people that are coming to your island on. Uh, if we go all the way up here, there's a, like a cool little bedroom right here, which is um, you know pretty sweet. You know you can like stay here. I, I like how they made it too. You know like without they didn't even use like the regular wool or anything. Like they put uh, another rack and some snow to make it look uh, nicer. I don't know. I think it looks nice. And then uh, you know you got your little uh, tables over there. And if we come up here, um, this is actually a pretty cool room. I'm not sure like what was the point of this over here. Um, I don't know if these are like throne, thrones or not, like I don't know if you like you can sit here or something. Um, but this is also something that comes with the island. Uh, some more storage space, uh, you got some uh, cool little like banner up there. And if we go all the way up to the top of the tower, um, I'm pretty sure there's just a bunch of like crafting tables and uh, yeah, crafting tables and jukeboxes that are up here. Um, so yeah, that's mostly it that's in this main tower. If we go back down, um, hopefully my pro will land, there we go. Uh, we can come back here. I'm, I haven't been back here yet, so I'm not really sure what's behind. Uh, is there really anything down here? Um, I don't think so. Yeah, okay, there's not really much down here. Uh, okay, yep, yeah, nothing. I don't even know. What, what is that water that's coming down here? Oh, okay. Oh, wow, that's actually really cool. They have, like, their uh, cool little sugarcane farm back here. Um, so if we go... Okay, well, can I not fall? So if we go um, down here, I know there's actually another really cool room uh, that is down here. So if we just hop down, I'm not going to use the ladders. Uh, you got some cactuses over here and um, like a pretty, uh, I don't know, a pretty nice uh, nether themed room. Comes with like nether wart soul sand. You got some magma blocks over here. Um, some lava that you can use to uh, complete the obsidian challenge with. So yeah, uh, this is a pretty cool island. I really like how the sky god one looks. If you guys want me to review all of the other ranks, like the Knight Island and the Duke Island, I'm not even sure if there is like a custom. Okay, I'm I'm pretty sure there's a custom donor rank for them, like a uh, for all the ranks. But the Sky God one looks the best, so I just wanted to show you guys what this one looked like. Um, if you guys have any questions about this one, feel free to PM me in game. And I can talk to you guys more about it. Uh, so yeah, I'll see you guys in a second. Okay, guys. So if you saw um, when I do slash C H A or uh, slash C. Um, as you can see, we have 29 out of 32 obsidian, so we just need a couple more, uh, three more. So we're going to go buy three lava buckets now and complete this challenge. Uh, dang, dude, lava buckets actually cost a lot of money, though, which is uh, 
I don't know. I don't know why I cost this much, but I mean, I guess we'll all have to do it. So if we go back to our home now, I'm going to go place the buckets and we're going to go make them into obsidian and um, complete this challenge finally, which is like, I've been trying to complete the challenge for a while now. So I'm pretty happy that I'm about to finish it today. So if we do, okay, well, that did not work. Oh my God. And that just ruined that. And I just, really, really, just more work for me. Okay, well, that was a complete fail, guys. I'm going to go mine this back later, but um, I forgot. I forgot that you're supposed to place, like, the lava on top. I mean, the water on top. So, like, this, well, that didn't work either, dude. That did not work either. All right, guys, so I finally got it working now. Um, we can finally, you know, mine this obsidian right here. I wonder if this, I wonder if an obsidian gen is a thing, dude. I have no, okay, yup. Oh, it's definitely not a thing, dude. Definitely not a thing. So we're going to go take this lava back now. And uh, place the water here this time. Yep, there we go. And uh, since I wasted one lava, we're going to have to go get uh, another bucket back, which kind of sucks. But um, we'll go back to spawn and grab that real quick. And I'll see you guys in a second. Oh, that was a complete fail too. All right, guys, so we are back on the island, and we're going to go finish the challenge now, finally. Uh, so we place some water there. There we go. So our final 32 or 32nd um, obsidian. Uh, dude, hello. Okay, well, I don't know what this guy is doing, but hello, Jason. Hello, if you're watching this video. There we go, guys. Boom, we just got $2,500 and a rare book. Wait, what? 16 diamond pickaxes? What the? Um... I'm not sure what that is, but I just got 16 diamond pickaxes. What the heck? Well, I guess I, I guess I'll take that, man. What the? All right, we're gonna pop open this rare book now, see what we can get. Oh, poison one. Wow, terrible percents too. Oh well. Um, is there any other challenges that we can do? All right, we're gonna try to go do this um, challenge now. I'm not sure if we'll ever, we'll ever get this one done since I don't have a spawner, uh, so I might do that off camera. But for now, we're gonna go try to finish this. Um, challenge. So I'm gonna get all the materials and then we're gonna uh, cut back to when I have everything ready. Alright guys, so after a while we fi finally gathered all the materials that we need. Oops, I didn't mean to hit escape. Uh, so we're gonna go spawn the tree now because this is gonna be our first uh, quest. We gotta get some uh, wood for the planks. Um, hopefully this works. I think this is how to craft planks, right? I'm not sure that you know like the wording of these qu uh, challenges are kind of weird. Um, but if we do this, it should hopefully give us that quest. Um, yes, wait, what? Cla crafted two item frames? I didn't even craft an item frame. Oh, um, okay. Wait, this, this is kind of weird. It, it says task, craft the following, bookshelf, planks, item frames, and painting. But then it says bookshelf, signs, item frames, and paintings. <laughs> I like how there's two S's. Um, so yeah, I don't know what, what that is, but um, we're going to go, I guess. Well, I didn't even know I needed to craft bookshelves. I didn't see that at first, so I guess we're going to have to do that. Um, and then we're gonna do the paintings. Uh, so we'll do the actually we'll do the paintings really quick. Um, so hopefully I know how to craft paintings. Um, I'm kind of a bad crafter, so uh, this should work. Uh, oh my! I should not have turned that all into um, sticks, but oh well. Okay, so that's one painting. Please work. Okay, no, we're gonna use the purple wool since I won't use it that much. Three and four. There we go. Um, so C H A. What is next? I think it's gonna be the bookshelf one, right? All right, we're gonna do the bookshelf and then the sign. Um, we can actually do the sign one right now. Did I just throw out my sticks? I think I did. Okay, that is that's pretty bad. All right, we're gonna go spot another tree. Um, if you, if you guys are wondering, uh, I'm not really um you know like that worried about the leaves and everything because they usually just despawn on their own. Uh, so yeah, that's why I'm not really caring. I'm just spawning trees everywhere. Uh, so we're gonna go get. The craft the signs now. Actually, we're gonna do signs first, and then we'll do bookshelves next. So if we go over here, and um, I'm pretty sure that I'm pretty sure this is how you craft a sign. Okay, yep, there we go, man. I'm like one of the worst. I'm like a terrible um, crafting person since I usually just do mostly PvP. Um, so we're gonna go over here now, grab uh, any wood we can find, and then where's my bookshelf? Because we're gonna go use the books um, when I mine these bookshelves to uh, craft the craft them back into bookshelves, I guess. Yeah. Uh, so if we place these over here, and then we mine them back, it should give me books. Okay, yep, there we go. Uh, I think we have to craft eight, right? So um, let's let's just see if this works first. So I put my books like that. Put the wood. Uh, we'll just use this one since we have a lot of that. Um, two. All right, so that's two. Uh, do another one. That's three. Four. 
Okay, well, we ran out of wood on the bottom. Five. Okay, yep, we can't craft that one until we get some more wood. Uh, do I have enough books, though? Okay, no, I don't even have enough books. So we're going to go get a couple more books, grab a couple more planks, and um, uh, we should be finished with this one uh, pretty quickly. So where are my planks? Man, I, I really need to organize these chests, man. They're, like, completely just random. I just have random stuff everywhere. Uh, is there any... Do I even have wood? I don't think I have any wood. Well, I hope this is enough. I really hope this is enough wood. Oh, oh, it's not looking like enough. I like how I'm just using like a bunch of random, um, random type of planks for this. So weird. Okay, oh, so we don't have enough. So we're going to go back to spawn. Hey, well, actually, we don't even have to go back to spawn. What am I talking about? Um, we can just spawn another tree with the saplings. Um, see, look, so you guys can see this, uh, these leaves already went away. Um, I'm not sure what, like, the leaves, uh, like, over here are for. Like, I don't know why they're not going away. It's probably, like, a piece of, um, oak wood somewhere, which is, uh, keeping it from despawning. But, uh, I don't know, it kind of looks nice, so I just left it there. I didn't really mind. Uh, so, we should have enough wood now. Um, we're going to craft our final, the final, uh, bookshelves. Alright, yeah, this has to be enough. Boom, there we go, we finished. So we got $2,350. And um, it doesn't look like we got any items, so I think that is it. Uh, we're not going to do this challenge. We might save this for another time, but I hope you guys all enjoyed this episode. Uh, this was a pretty short one. Um, I just wanted to know if you guys, you know, if you, would you guys like to see me do the challenges for my videos? Do you guys want to see more PvP? Um, after this clip, uh, actually, no, no, okay. I'm, I'm going to put the PvP actually before um, this uh, little challenge type of thing. So yeah, I hope you guys all enjoyed that little PvP clip, by the way. Um, if you guys want to see me record here more, uh, make sure to tell me in the comments down below what you guys want to see. Like, if you guys want to see me do um, challenges, or do you guys want me to, like, tour other people's islands, uh, whatever you guys want, I'll do it. So make sure to comment your suggestion down below. Um, thank you guys all for watching, and I'll see you guys all next time. Peace out.